Unveiling the mystery of the dead of night. Hello everyone, and welcome to our English language learning series. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating English phrase, the dead of night. This expression is not just a literal term, but it carries a deeper, more nuanced meaning. So, let's explore it together and expand our understanding of the English language. The dead of night is a phrase that paints a vivid picture in English. It refers to the very late hours of the night, especially those close to midnight or the early hours before dawn. It's a time perceived as the quietest, darkest, and most still part of the night. This section will explore how the words dead and night combine to create a unique meaning that goes beyond their individual definitions. Did you know that this phrase has historical roots? The dead of night is not a modern invention but has been in use for centuries. It's believed to have originated from a time when the concept of night was associated with silence, inactivity, and mystery. In this section, we'll delve into the historical context and see how this phrase has evolved over time. The dead of night is not just used in everyday conversation. It has been a favorite in literature and media. Authors and filmmakers often use it to set a scene of suspense, mystery, or quiet introspection. We'll look at some famous examples from books and movies to understand how this phrase enhances the mood and setting. How do we use the dead of night in everyday English? This section will provide practical examples and scenarios. Whether it's describing a time of day, setting a scene in a story, or just using it metaphorically, understanding this phrase can add depth to your English conversations. It's easy to misunderstand the dead of night as something eerie or related to ghostly hours. However, this interpretation misses the mark. We'll clear up some common misconceptions and ensure you can use the phrase accurately and confidently. We hope this exploration of the dead of night has been enlightening and adds a new dimension to your English vocabulary. Remember, English is a language rich with expressions that paint vivid images and convey deep meanings. Keep learning, and soon you'll master the art of English expressions. Thank you for watching, and we look forward to bringing you more interesting insights into the English language.